The reality of the situation is, Stevie, that you are entitled on any view to half of the community asset that the two of you bought together. You jointly owned it and there was only a month in between buying it and between Eddie selling it. And in those circumstances, I found that you jointly owned it and you're entitled to, the, to half that you paid for it. What you can't do when you uh, come to court is get a better version of something you bought. In other words, for the court to provide you with something you haven't paid for and put you in a position, a better position, than you would have been in than in the circumstances that Eddie hadn't sold the amp in the first place. To that end, you're entitled to the value you paid for it, which is £700, which you both agree. And in the circumstances, seeing as you jointly owned it, you're entitled to £350. That's half the value of the amp you purchased. Um, and so the award of this court is to you, Stevie, for £350. In the meantime, it seems to me it's rather sad that you've had to come to court to deal with this. I think that perhaps <laughs> the two of you could go and make happy music with each other outside. I don't see why not. I don't see why not either. <laughs>